What is going on YouTube and welcome to another upload. And of course it is not doing anything like yesterday. <laughs> so apparently I guess YouTube is doing this now where it just shows a Cyberlink UCAM and please start UCAM I guess. Uh, since I don't have a cam, there's only the uh, thing on top of my computer and wow this thing is slow. Okay. That's kind of a bit odd but alright. Anyway, so um, I did an upload yesterday, and uh, I didn't really get time to talk to you guys. I was actually uh, online Clone Wars Adventures, which I'm going to be talking about today, uh, since I got some good time. And uh, yeah, yesterday I didn't really get to talk to you guys because I was actually online at the shopping area glitch, where an Enforcer came online. It was uh, Enforcer 13, I think. So yeah, I got I think um uh I think I got like around ten screenshots of Enforcer thirteen. Uh, uh that was just like exciting. <laughs> so I really do apologize to you guys. I didn't get to talk to you yesterday. Uh believe it or not, I am actually still online on Clone Wars Adventures right now with my friend Sab the Legend. Um and I'm still on the shopping area glitch. I think it's just me and Sav here, right? Yeah. So I don't know what's going on uh, with the game and whatnot. But anyway, uh, but before I get to the game, today I happen. Or wait, today's Wednesday, right? It was yesterday. I forgot to I forgot to uh, show you guys. Yesterday was Tuesday, and that also is a big. That was a big day for me. Uh, Star Wars Darth Maul Lockdown. It's actually called Maul Lockdown. Uh, it came out yesterday, and yeah, this book is, I've been waiting for this book to come out ever since it was uh, previewed. Now hang on real quick, I have my game on, I want to see if I can, uh, just to make sure you guys can see it, okay. So yeah, I'm all locked down, I'm on chapter 2 right now, and I did not realize it was freaking 74 chapters. <laughs> so yeah, that's going to be fun. Oh no, never mind, I'm on chapter 3. Uh, but anyway. Yeah, uh, Star Wars Mall Lockdown is uh, is getting pretty interesting, even though I'm only on Chapter 3, and I don't even know how many pages this is, like, this is, three, oh, okay, I thought it was like a thousand pages or something, it's only like 300 pages, or probably more than that, and uh, I also got the new Star Wars Insider at Barnes Noble, well, that's where I also got the Mall Lockdown. Anyway, uh, so yeah, and the sun's coming up on Clone Wars Adventures too. And uh, <laughs> all righty then. So anyway, um, hello. <laughs> anyway, uh, anyway, um, Clone Wars Adventures. So I didn't get to talk to you guys a little bit. I didn't get to talk to you guys much about it. Um, so yeah, sadly the rumors are true. Um, Clone Wars Adventures is ending March. Oops, I don't want that. Oh uh, yeah, uh, Star Wars Clone Wars Adventures is ending on March 31st. They also, if you guys don't believe me, go to their website. I'll also post a link to it. I'll post two links to it on the description below. The first link is going to be on their website, and the second link is going to be on their forums. But uh, yeah, uh, I have a terrible voice, I know this, and I apologize for that. You guys probably think otherwise, that I don't have a terrible voice, but oh well. I'm going to read you guys what it says on the Intergalactic News. <clears throat> Give me one second. Yeah. Anyway, uh, so yeah. With heavy hearts, we announce the sunset of Clone Wars. Adventures. Dear CWA players, it is with sadness that I announce the news that Star Wars Clone Wars Adventures will end March 31st, 2014. We've had many incredible experiences with you over the years. We fought epic battles and made unbelievable memories. It was a very difficult decision to make, but we all knew this day would come eventually. Most importantly, I want to thank all of you, all of the players, for their time and commitment to the game. You have made this Star Wars experience truly unforgettable. Stay tuned for more details on what the next two months will be like. Uh, well, 
will look like. Steve George, producer of Sony Online Entertainment. So that's what was posted on the website. And to be honest, I I mean their update came out. Um, when was it? Uh, this month? Wait, wait, this. Yeah, so, uh, January. Hang on, real quick. Okay. Uh, anyway. Oh yeah, yeah. Uh, so yeah, today is uh, January 29th, and a few days is gonna be February. And that's gonna be really depressing too, because we're gonna only have like one month left or so. But anyway, uh, if you go online, Clone Wars Adventures, and you go to the uh, Galactic Mail Communicator, you click on Communicator, and they already have this week's brand new items out. Not this week, not February. It was January, and it was the three pack Starfighters and the mining or hidden mining asteroid lot. Um, I don't get why Sony Online Entertainment. I know they're shutting down, but they still have their on their website. They have check out this week's brand new items, which was the Orto Pl Plutonia Holiday Lot and uh, the Astromech Droid or Astromech Droid R141. That's it's unbelievable. But, uh, anyway, holy crap, my screen just, there we go. So, yeah, um, what I'm going to be talking to you guys about is my memories on Clone Wars Adventures. And this is basically going to be dedicated to the sunset of Clone Wars Adventures. And, yes, if you guys are looking behind me, that's my dog cheering on his foot. Or biting on his foot, whatever. Her foot. Whatever. Oh, how did I, never mind. <laughs> I'm getting soft track. I'm actually hungry right now. It's like 5.20 in the afternoon. I'm, uh, I got dinner coming soon, so... I gotta make this quick. So anyway, um... <clears throat> Clone Wars Adventures. It really made my childhood a lot more easier. Um, anytime I had stress, I would automatically go online and just hang out with all my online friends and chat with people and just build stuff, right? We go back online, and there's no two more people here. But yeah, uh, January 27th, I think. 28, 20, I think so. January 27th, 2011 was the day I registered for Clone Wars Adventures, and through 2011 through 2014 it has been truly great. It has been a true experience to actually just create your own character online and just everything uh, you get to meet people online you get to hang out with them you get to build your own houses whatever you want I think it was back in 2012 that Sony Online Entertainment got hacked their entire system got hacked and every single registered player on Clone Wars Adventures also got hacked and uh, that was the big month that we didn't get to play Clone Wars Adventures I don't really remember when that was but that was truly just unbelievable. It was like a month and a half or something. Um, but yeah, I've had just like truly great experience on this game. You you get to actually experience what it's like to be, say, like a Jedi Knight or a Ultimate Sith Lord or a Clone Trooper, a Mercenary, Bounty Hunter, whatever you want to say. Uh, they've had many system updates in their past experience, or I'm sorry, in their past updates. Um, and so far, to be honest guys, I'm just going to say this because since Clone Wars is ending, I'm going to let out all my true facts, all my true opinions. To be honest guys, I really love the older version of Clone Wars Adventures. I really love the old model better. Um, I know it's not like the new version. I mean, you have your character's screen name on the upper left corner you got your actions on the up, on the middle corner on the middle left corner and you got the world chat on the bottom left corner and then you have like say um, your mission long on the right corner and your entire space bar on the bottom and it's just I mean I'm not complaining I really love it I love any update they do but um if only I could show you online instead of this, but I don't really know how. <laughs> anyway, 
But yeah, I've created Dark Emperor Snake, and he's been through a difficult life. Um, me and the Snake, seeing how I'm his creator, we bonded very amazingly. It's just, I've had such amazing friends on Clone Wars Adventures that I'm really going to miss dearly. Uh, I've had great squad members, squad leaders. I have to say, I even said this before in the past, my ultimate goal in the past was to actually be in Dark Nebula with their leader, Ag um, Alexandra Nova. Or, I'll, I am like terribly sorry that I'm pronouncing your um, down that I'm not pr pronouncing your name good, but um, yeah, I'm just gonna say Nova. But anyway, she. To be honest, she was the best leader I could ever have. I mean, I've stuck with her, I've stuck by her side the entire rest of the year, and believe it or not, I'm still in her squad to this day, and I'm going to be stay staying in this squad until this game ends. We've only got... I'm a general, and another friend of mine is a general, and it's just the mistress that is the leader. It's only three people. And, uh... Yeah, it's just, like, really heartbreaking. I'm not going to be able to see her, I'm not going to be able to talk to her, I'm not going to be able to visit her Nebula town. Nothing. All of that will be gone. I'm like, I don't even have her name on the Old Republic yet. I'm trying to get it. But, uh, then again, though, she has a busy life, and I need to start focusing on my life after this game ends. And uh, <clears throat> It's just really depressing, you know? It's like, all this stuff you built into Clone Wars... No. All the stuff you built in the Clone Wars Adventures is just going to be gone. I mean, Halloween was the absolute best month I've ever had on Clone Wars Adventures. Uh, this, or no, last year they didn't really do anything new. It was just same simple stuff. <coughs> Sorry about that. Uh, Life Day was, was pretty good. They had a couple of new stuff. Make sure my video is ending. Okay, good. Um, but yeah, I mean, just, it's, it's just really sad to actually see this game go. I mean, wow. Um, yeah. And I also got news that, uh, the Clone Wars Adventures forums will only last one more day after the game shuts down, so. We're not going to be having the game, we're not going to be having the forums. It's like, seriously, you're actually doing this to us? I mean, I understand that so many layoffs have been dedicated to SOE. They've laid off a lot of people. They've lost a lot of money. And that's why this game is ending. It's just terrible. I've had, like, just so, so much fun with this game, you know? I'm 16 right now. I don't... The interest I had with Clone Wars Adventures long ago was is gone now because I'm more focused on the Old Republic and it's just it's just sad man I mean, it's, I'm not getting so upset about it like I would if I were younger if I was like younger I'd be crying right now <laughs> no but um yeah it's just wow what can I say? Um, I gotta get before this game ends. I need to get screenshots of what I've built. Um, I'm definitely gonna get screenshots of Alexander Nova's uh, Nebula Town. I'm gonna get screenshots of absolutely everything. I think I have almost 2,000 screenshots. <laughs> but um, yeah. So just wow. And uh. The most credits I've ever made on this game was, believe it or not, one million. I've actually reached that goal. Sadly, I didn't stick with it. And one thing led to another. I started building my houses, and soon enough, that one million was gone. And now I'm stuck with 181,780 Republic credits. <laughs> yeah. So anyway, if you guys were wondering what the hell was all of that last night, I am like I, I do apologize again last night. Um, where I'm standing right now is the exact place where the Enforcer 13 was standing. 
and uh, I got so distracted with that. And I started taking so many screenshots of the Enforcer 13 that I get, didn't get to talk to you guys that much. And um, yeah, it's just I'm sorry about that again. Um, uh, yeah, I just. <laughs> Oh boy. So anyway. Uh but yeah. On the forums though, I have made my last story for Dark Emperor Snake. Um what else? I'm not sure if I'm gonna be spending all my credits before the uh before the game ends. Because as you remember me saying in the beginning of the up uh, in the beginning of the upload they said uh, to stick around with them to see what the next two months would be like, what what they would look like. So I'm saving my Republic credits and my station cash for that. There could be absolutely anything they're going to do. They, who knows? They could be bringing back weekly updates before this game is. They, hell, they could be, they could probably bring Camino Combat Zone. Who knows? I doubt it though. Um. But yeah, it's just so. It's just it's weird. Come back here. Right. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I've been getting a few screenshots lately. And, uh, let me minimize this real quick. There we go. So yeah. Um, so once the once Clone Wars Adventures ends, I'm going to be focusing on my life in particular and the Old Republic. I'm going to try and get my Jedi Knight to level 55 and my Jedi Concealer to level 55. So, that being said, I've discussed Clone Wars Adventures and we're gaining on 18 minutes so far. Oh, not really. It's beginning of 17. Uh, I don't think I have anything new to show you guys. So, I think that's it. So I'll be seeing you guys later, and if I do any new uploads, I will be sure to let you guys know. Let me get those links posted to the description below, and I will be seeing you guys later. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, talk to you later, guys.